Welcome to step nine, creating the required namespaces. In this step, we're going to create the namespaces that will be required when we create the role and role bindings in subsequent steps. The first thing to notice is the manifest file that describes the two namespaces we're going to create. The first namespace is dev, and the second namespace is test. So let's apply that manifest file. Now you can see down here is that both the devs and test namespaces has been created. But let's make sure and execute the kube control get namespace command using Catacoda's interactive command facility. Okay, and there you go. And you can see that we have test and we have devs. So next step is we're going to create the cluster for the new user.